Daddy, can I go on your date with you? No, no. Dating, that's something you'll do when you're, well, in your 30s. <laughs> Good night. My daddy's always leaving me. How come? Because he's spatula of the month. <laughs> if you say so. I want to go on my daddy's date. But your daddy said no. Then we have to be very sneaky. Uh, we? That's right. You're my date. <laughs> we did it! I've never been that quiet in my whole life. Me neither. Let's go surprise him. But there's no chairs for us. Here's a bigger table. Daddy! Excuse me. Who are you here with? My daddy. He's on a date. Oh, so that'll be four. <laughs> I'll start with a Happy Meal. What she's having with the whole the pickle. <laughs> Whoa, baby, they're the happy meal. <laughs> Grab a fork. <laughs> Daddy's missing all the fun. Daddy. Uh, Danny, there's a young lady waving at you. Oh, yeah, I know. It's all part of the price I pay for being Bachelor of the Month. Well, I don't want to make you jealous, so uh, I'm not even going to look. No, really, you you ought to look. Daddy, you got to try the Happy Meal. Oh, my God, it's my daughter. Michelle, how did you get here? In your car, we were hiding in the back seat. If we're in trouble, it was her idea. <laughs> Well, you're both definitely in trouble. Please, into the booth, both. Is everything all right? No. My daughter and her friend stowed away in my car. Michelle, why did you do that? Because I never see you anymore. Is that because you're the spatula of the mom? Eat your dessert, Teddy. Michelle. How could you say you never see me anymore? I see you every morning, and I told you a bedtime story tonight. Before dinner doesn't count, you don't tuck me in anymore. Sweetheart, if I'm not able to tuck you in for some reason, there's always someone else there to tuck you in. It's not the same. You do the best tugboat. Actually, she has a point there. I, I do one heck of a toot toot. <laughs> but that does not excuse you from leaving the house and sneaking into my car. Why in big trouble? Well, actually, it's not all your fault. I should have talked to you about this whole dating thing before I started going out every night. I know how important it is to you that I tuck you in. It's important to me, too. I love our special times together. I'll tell you what. Why don't you and I make a special date tomorrow night at your bedtime for me to tuck you in? What do you say? Is it a date? It's a date. I love you, honey. I love you, Daddy. Danny, since we're all here, why don't we make this a double date? Okay. Well, if you'll excuse me, I'll call home and tell them that the kids are okay. <laughs> Wonder how much she tipped for that booth. <laughs> here we go. This is okay with your daddy, right? Right. 